So, if you if you check with the distorted molecules according to the Vespers theory, if you take examples, the continuation of the examples, examples of distorted distorted molecules, distorted molecules that is here we can take ammonia is a distorted molecule and water is also a distorted molecule because if you take ammonia as already we have discussed in the Lewis electron dot structure method for the formation of covalent bond in ammonia and water molecule. Right now you can see that ammonia contains one lone pair and oxygen contains two lone pairs. This itself speaks that the ammonia molecules and water molecules are already distorted. So if you go to the shape we can see that ammonia is having three bonds, three covalent bonds that is nitrogen, hydrogen, three covalent bonds are there with one lone pair. So you can find that here we can find one lone pair of electron and three bond pair of electrons. So here you are finding that this ammonia molecule in this ammonia molecule there are two types of bonds, two types of low, two types of electrons. One is the lone pair of electrons, lone pair electrons and you have bond pair electrons are there in the ammonia molecule. So the kind of repulsions taking place in the ammonia molecule you can see actually the expected shape of the ammonia molecule is tetrahedral uh, and its bond angle that is expected shape expected shape expected shape is tetrahedral tetrahedral if it is tetrahedral its bond angle should be 109 degrees 28 minutes if you don't consider the Vespers theory for this ammonia molecule then the expected shape of ammonia molecule is tetrahedral and the bond angle is 109 degrees 28 minutes but if you consider according to the Vespers theory if you consider in this ammonia molecule both lone pair electrons and bond pair electrons because of the lone pair and bond pair electrons here you find two types of repulsions taking place in the ammonia molecule with respect to the central atom of ammonia two types of repulsions are taking place one is lone pair to bond pair repulsions in ammonia molecule are greater than bond pair to bond pair repulsions. that is why the expected shape becomes actual shape of ammonia molecule now it is pyramidal now it is pyramidal with a bond angle of 107 degrees if you consider Vespers theory so this is one of the important aspect which you have to keep it in mind for the ammonia molecule the same discussion what we have made for ammonia molecule the same discussion we have to make even for water molecule ammonia molecule is over now go for water molecule if you go for water molecule here in water molecule H2O oxygen is the central atom so if you go for oxygen as a central atom then this oxygen has two bonds oxygen hydrogen bonds and it has two lone pairs from the central atom it has two lone pairs and two bond pairs so from the from the structure of the water molecule again it is clear that this water molecule contains lone pair electrons and uh, bond pair electrons it has again lone pair electrons and bond pair electrons because it has two lone pairs lone pair of electrons in water molecule around the central atom oxygen in water molecule you have two lone pair of electrons and two bond pair of electrons with two covalent bonds here the kind of repulsions taking place are the repulsions taking place so here electronic repulsions we can say that lone pair to lone pair repulsions in water molecules are greater than lone pair to bond pair electrons uh, repulsions are greater than bond pair to bond pair repulsions because three types of repulsions are taking place lone pair to lone pair repulsions are taking place lone pair to bond pair repulsions are taking place and bond pair to bond pair repulsions are taking place because of these three kinds of repulsions which are taking place in the water molecule the molecule becomes distorted the expected again expected expected shape is expected shape is tetrahedral tetrahedral with a bond angle of 109 degrees 28 minutes but because of the repulsions the actual shape 
the actual shape now it turns to angular with a decrease in bond angle from 109 degrees 28 minutes to bond angle decrease to 104 degrees 5 minutes this decrease in the bond angle and change in the shape of water molecule is based on the Vespers theory according to the Vespers theory the central atom oxygen in water molecule is undergoing all three types of repulsions lone pair to lone pair lone pair to bond pair and bond pair to bond pair repulsion that is why the molecule has been distorted and now the shape of the water molecule has become angular and its bond angle has decreased from 109 degrees 28 minutes to 104 degrees 5 minutes